In this short tutorial, I'm going to show you how to install and set up Craigslist Autoresponder Pro for Joomla. Once you've logged into your control panel, simply go to Installers, choose Components, and then browse into your hard drive to locate the zip file that you downloaded from our site, and click Upload File. You'll see that you need to set up a company profile, email, message, Craigslist, RSS, URL to monitor, then attach a user. So let's go ahead and do that. We'll go into Components and choose Craigslist Autoresponder. And under Company Manager, let's click New. And name of the company, uh, we're going to just put in my name, Bill Pryor. And it is the only required field. Uh, so for the sake of this brief tutorial, we're going to leave everything else blank and click Save. And now that we've got our company profile set up, we now can see our Manage Letter, Manage RSS, and Assign User Icons. So let's start with the email message. Click on New. And what I want to do in this uh, example is monitor Craigslist for free firewood. After you key in your email message, click Save, and then click Back. And now let's assign an RSS URL. Click New here. And we're going to go to Craigslist to do that. I'm in the Tampa Bay area, and I want to monitor free area. And only in Pinellas County so it's close by and I'm gonna do a search for uh, oak firewood We've got 15 matches I'm gonna go down and click on RSS and then take the URL from my address bar and paste it right in here and now that since the keywords are already here in the URL I can leave the keywords blank you can also just choose the URL and then choose your keywords and put them in this box below. Let's click on Save here and then Back. And finally, we're going to assign a user. And the only user that I have in this account is admin because this is just a demo site and this is pulled from your Joomla users. And this is the company profile we just created. Let's click on Save here and back once again. I also want to show you that in cPanel you can get copies of each email sent to you. Now if you're on some sort of uh, shared hosting account or, or even a GoDaddy dedicated account where there's only a thousand SMTP relays per day you may not want to have this on because you want to limit the number of emails that are being sent out. Uh, let's just go ahead and cancel out of this and we're ready to go and the way we're going to do this is we're going to just go to preview we're going to preview the site in a new tab and uh, you can click contact us on your website to get the beginning of the URL ready and then all you got to do is change this to com underscore craigslist autoresponder just hit enter and the page will reload as an empty shell of your site with no content. That means that the routine has kicked off successfully. Okay, so I just came into Microsoft Outlook and ran a send and receive routine and we can see here that uh, two, four, six unique emails were found. You know, one of the things that the system does is it sorts out unique emails so that you're not sending uh, posters multiple emails to the same address. Now of course if they're using the Craigslist remailer uh, it makes it a little bit difficult and the remailer means that the emails are going out to this address instead of just a standard address uh, you know like Yahoo Gmail or their own domain name uh, email address. Now there's one more thing that you would want to do if more than 10 were just queued or sent out rather if, if there was more than 10 matches only 10 emails would go out and then all the rest would be put into a queue for send later and either instance they're only gonna go out 10 at a time 
and that's because if you send too many emails through Craigslist uh, you'll get banned for 24 hours. So the second routine all you have to do is add to the URL and task equals send later. Now I'm going to go ahead and hit this and we're going to see that there are no emails in the queue. 